Welcome to Kalyan Classroom. Today, I am going to show you how to install and work with OBS software, Open Broadcasting Software. It is a free tool mainly used for recording and live streaming. And also, I will show you the list of 30 open softwares exclusively for audio, video, image, live streaming, and screen capturing purpose. So these are the some of the features of OBS software and just to go through this list, these are the free tools for audio video editings and even for live streaming purpose. So now before getting into that, we have to install the OBS software. Now I'm going to show how we can install the OBS software. First, we have to go to the um, browse place, OBS download and click enter. We'll be seeing this OBS project.com. This is that size. We can click that. It will be opening this screen. Here we can see Linux versions. So here, simply we have to click on that. Or our work is simply click on this. So if you are clicking that, it will be getting downloaded. So after downloading, you can see, you can see, see it is downloading. I don't want because already the downloading completed. So after that, just to go there, see in the folder where it has been located and double click it, it will be getting start to install. Uh, the installation will be very simple. X next kind of policy. Finally, you have to finish button. That's it. It's very easily you can install in case if you are facing any problem. There are some reasons. So those things are your OS should be updated. If your operating system is not updated, you cannot you will be facing this kind of the errors. Apart from that, uh, you have to verify that you are a Java also updated or not. So for uh, seeing that Java, in the start button, you can type Java. Java, you see, Java mission. Yes, this is. So here you have to click and you can see for the updations. Still, if you are getting any error, copy the error, go to the Google search bar. This is the see for the look for the suggestions and follow the suggestions you can come up from the problem. So this is how we can do that. So I am assuming that you already installed that software. So once if you are installing, you can see that OBS. This is the icon of OBS. Double click it. So if you are double clicking that, you will be coming to this interface. So this is how the interface will be looks like. The interface is very colorful. How the OBS is used to capture your face, face recording while you are giving the lecture. We can record our face. So we can keep our face somewhere in the uh, bottom or very top, small size or bigger size, so that the viewers can see our face also. So for that, we have to go to the resources, click on the play symbol, take the, the a video capture device. So you can say okay for this. So here we can see the the face. Hi. And you can see okay. You can minimize this. You can place any place in the monitor. So the blue line, the blue box, this rectangle is nothing but your screen capture. Right? Now uh, the picture also is there. The screen also is capturing the start. The recording also going on. Now I'm going to the screen. I'm going to screen. Now I want to play this. I'm presenting the PPT using the keys. You can go. So this is how we can record it. Hello, welcome to Kalyan Classroom. Right. You can see. So here. 
the voices from outside by using this mic. This music and display is from the within the system. So both the things also will be captured. That is done with the help of this one. You see here in the audio mixer, we are able to see the three ones. No. So the middle one is the blinking. So this is nothing but mic and auxiliary. This is video capture device. When the video is going on, the video also along with this audio also will be captured. So these are the devices along with its mixing the controls. These controls can be controlled with the help of this control. So once if you are doing the simple exercise, easily you can understand. Now this is the uh, the face recording. If you want to delete that, you select that, you select that, and come to this one video capture. Use the minus symbol. So if you are giving minus symbol, it is asking, are you sure I uh, wish to remove? Yes. So it has been removed. Like that, we can record the face recording. The face recording, the procedure is clear to you. You can try and you can see that. Now I will stop recording. After stopping, you can go to the file, show recording. It will be recorded here. You right click it and go to the open with you pick up any one Windows Media Player or some other tools. You click that, you can see and enjoy your video. So this is how it is working. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned.